Hello there, peoples of the internet. Once again to another devlog. Woo! Alright, so this is going to probably be a pretty quick one because I've kind of been in a slump lately with schoolwork and other stuff. Um, I'm actually playing, as you notice, on the same version of the game as I was before because there's not much I can actually show. It's just stuff that I've been um, in the process of working on. Um, so basically, the update with the game um, this week is that I've really started um, to overhaul the, um, the inventory and, and item system because basically it doesn't work. It isn't supportive for a sort of diverse and varying and, and really large system of inventories. Like if I just had my one inventory, like my main inventory, and that was it, or like if I just had my main inventory and the crafting oh. menu, then that would be fine. Um, but that's not the case. Like, I have an infinite amount of, well, technically it, it could be infinite amount of inventories to account for. Basically because of the chests being everywhere, each chest should have its own um, inventory when you click it. It doesn't in this version of the game, but it will, obviously. Um, and uh, I've shown that off in other versions. I think in this version it's disabled. But, um... That, and when you kill an enemy, instead of just disappearing, if I can find an enemy, they were all over the place a second ago, up here. Um, so, if I just kill this guy without dying. Okay, so right now he just freezes in place because I don't have art for it, but, uh, and he's dropped stuff, but um, the real plan is that he'll die, he'll, you'll see the like dead body, it'll either be a permanent or it'll be like there for a, a substantial amount of time and you'll be able to click on the body just like you would a chest it would open up an inventory a uh, little like um, sort of yeah like a sort of inventory of what the that enemy had on him like all the loot and you can just take what what you want from him so um, as you can see that means that inventory has to be very it has this the system has to support basically an infinite amount of inventories and it doesn't so i've started to overhaul how it works it will still have the same sort of gameplay you'll still have the um, size based inventory where you can move stuff around where you can pick it up flip it around all like this you can you know uh put it in other things like this and so forth so on and so forth but it just is super buggy right now um as you can see also like when I opened up the inventory for the first time, I just randomly dropped a couple of items, so that's not right. And half the time the items actually go in, on top of one another, so that's also a problem. So, yeah, that's something that really needs to get fixed, like here, an item went on top of another item. So, yeah, that's, that's basically what's going on with the game right now. Um, I will definitely be keeping you guys posted. And basically, after this feature is done, after the inventory is overhauled, um, and after it's working, the game is going to be, uh, the demo rather, is going to be released. I, I, right now, I just started up a version, um, the latest version, and as you can see, the sun I was working on, there's also a moon, but the cycles are weird and off, and I was just messing around with where they would be. So, it's not actually off, but you can see how the sun sort of rotates. It's not the final art for the sun, probably, um, but yeah. So that's kind of where we're at right now. Like, as you can see right now, items are totally disabled, basically. Um, you can just move them around everywhere. I've disabled in the code the um, item feature at, for right now. And after that, the basic outlook for how the game is going to, how basically the schedule is going to work with uploads and everything, is I will be uploading a devlog, like an official one of these devlogs, every other week. So I'll, and then the week, after a devlog, the weekend after a devlog is released, I'll release an update to the game. So once the demo is out, which will hopefully be actually, I don't think I mentioned it, it'll hopefully be this coming week, um, this weekend, this next weekend, because I have a giant break from school and I'm able to work on the game and everything. But um, I'll be releasing the demo, then the next week I'll release, the next weekend I'll release a devlog. Then the next week I'll release a demo, and then a devlog, then a demo, devlog. So basically, um, I give you some a gist of what I'm working on for the two weeks, um, but I don't spoil basically everything, so there's something left for, uh, for the player to explore, and something worth downloading the game for. Um, it's also going to put less strain on devlog videos. Now that doesn't mean that I just won't be making videos um, at all, like 
that means that I'll probably be spending my time making some um, time-lapse videos of how I'm working on stuff. Maybe I'll do like some se uh, semi like mini devlogs or something like that. Um, it's all kind of up in the air right now, but that's just my current idea, my current plan. It's a very loose one. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it, guys. And yeah, goodbye.